isn't this how it's supposed to be? Making our Christmas memories. Oh oh, la da da da. Oh oh, la da da da. Oh oh, la da da da. Making our Christmas memories. Hello, Simmies, and welcome to or back to my channel. It's your girl, Simply Wive, and today I bring you another episode of Team Mom. Before we get into today's video, remember to like, comment, subscribe, and share my videos. Also, don't forget to turn on your post notifications so you never miss out when I post. Alright, Simmies, let's get into the video. Welcome to Simpsons Day 4. Yes, y'all, we are on Simpsons Day 4. Can y'all believe it? I don't know. I feel like these days have been just rolling right on by. It's just crazy. I'm glad that me and my Sim sisters are still staying motivated to complete this 31 days of Simsmas. And like I said, it's giving us content to share with you guys. So I hope that you guys are also enjoying it. And I'm just having a good time just watching everybody drop. And I'm just loving what everybody's posting. I'm just in a very good mood. So yeah, I hope that we are keeping everybody else's spirits up as well. But what happened in the last episode, y'all? Let's talk about it. Did y'all see Liana and Vincent's engagement photo shoots? Like they didn't have one outfit. They didn't have two outfits. They had three outfits. Three outfit changes, y'all. Like in every one day slay, they looked so freaking good. It was so hard to pick a thumbnail picture because they looked so good in all of those fits. They looked so good in the poses. They just looked really good. And it was really nice to have the girls be in one of the photos even though you know that was the only one we could snap it was still really cute to have them a part of it so that was the highlight of the last episode and she also did tell her dad her brother storm and her favorite cousin jasmine that she is engaged we haven't told her mom but i'm pretty sure by now somebody has told her mom but we can still officially announce it to her mom on another day maybe today who knows i'm ready to get into this episode i don't want to spend too much time talking because your girl likes to talk so let's go ahead and get into the episode let me get out of tab mode so right now it is 7 39 a.m and liana is getting ready to head to school she is just kissing the girls good night and tucking them in and yes my girl is in her all pink today she looks like a strawberry milkshake okay period um but let me show you guys what is going on so well, let me not do that. But let me show y'all what's going on. I just want to pause it because I don't want to head to school yet. Oh, she loves her babies. Okay. So let me show y'all what happened this morning. So y'all know Liana has worked before school. And one of her tasks today was to talk to an angel investor to get some funding. And y'all look, the investor was very happy with Liana's proposal. Liana got a decent investment of $1,372. Y'all, so not only did she get paid, but she got an investment of $1,372. Stop playing with her. And we still haven't paid the bills, y'all. Like, we really need to pay. The, we really need to pay the bills. Like, we're definitely going to do that when we get out of school today. I got to remember to do that. I might have her invite her mom over to announce the engagement tonight. And maybe she could cook dinner. We're going to join her. Um, yeah, so... We're gonna invite her mom, we'll cook dinner tonight and stuff and announce the engagement. And other than that, we don't really have much planned this episode. We're just gonna go with the flow. Uh, but last episode was so much fun and so cute and I really am in love with their thumbnail photo. But like I said, it was so hard to choose and they just looked so good. Like, I don't even wanna change their fits. I need them to go out in all the outfits that I made. <laughs> of them matching in their formal wear we gotta go out we gotta go out to dinners to shows to the movies to the i don't know everywhere we gotta go everywhere oh it's snowing again okay i wanted liana to finish her extra credit work because we're just really trying to stay like ahead of the game and she also needs to pump so after she finishes her extra credit remember we're gonna come in here to the nurse's office and we are going to pump. Is she going into the... I don't know why sometimes she like going in here to this principal to do her homework. I guess she's like, ain't really much she could tell me because I'm doing what I need to do. 
period, sis. But she likes sitting in here with him. I was thinking about giving him a makeover, y'all. But honestly, we need to get him fired. Like, for real. That's what we really need to do. And we just need to get a brand new principal, if we being real. But she's doing her homework. Also, she got a message this morning of this girl gossiping about Bob Pancakes. And the girl was like, Bob Pancakes stinks. I'm going to put the um, screenshot right here. Yeah, so that's what that girl said. Oh, he doing his homework too. But he like a grown man, but okay. Um, but that's what the girl said. And Liana was like, oh my gosh, that's what she responded. And now Liana, well, I don't know if she still has it, but she had a negative movie about gossiping. Like, where is it? Maybe she doesn't have it anymore, but she was upset about gossiping. I'm just like, girl. Uh-uh, girl, you're not about to get sick. Hold on, who's this? We can't chat. We need to go pump. Okay. So she just finished, or she's finishing up her extra credit. Perfect. And now she's going to go pump before 10 a.m. We're going to have her do that. And I'm definitely, if we have to teleport her, we will teleport her to class. Because we don't have any time to be playing around with her missing class and stuff. Or getting caught by this principal and having freaking... Um, detention. That's not what we're about to do. And I think, what's this? I think she found this out the laundry. Not foul. Quality foul. Rarity uncommon. A very small and hearty fish that's better than most. Oh, we got to throw that away. Oh, exam prep. Okay. I mean, we could have prepped for ourselves, though. But we already know Liana's doing so well. She's going to ace it. Like, stop playing with her. And then I'm just going to teleport her in here because she's not going to make it in time. And that's okay. Pumping is definitely more important. But like I said, I think uh, this weekend will start to wean her off of having to pump and wean Nalani off the boob and breast milk. Because she's getting a little bit older and she will just be, um, she will be switching over to solid foods and stuff so yeah it's gonna be a little bit sad because it's gonna be a while before we have another little baby in the house but that's okay let's attend our art class who we sitting beside today who is this fufu tanuli what's this wait carmen said you didn't seem like yourself today so i was checking on you you're good right we are good carmen thank you for checking in on us girl but since we good we more than good, shoot. We happy, we healthy, our babies are healthy. We in a wonderful relationship to our fiance. Stop playing with her. She's literally daydreaming right now, like Liana. Do your, take your notes, what you doing? Okay, at least she attended, but take some notes, girl. Ooh, she hungry. Yeah, we gonna get something to eat, babes. After she's done, I'm gonna have her come use the bathroom. Not take a pregnancy test. If y'all saw the end of the last part, y'all would know why I was saying take a pregnancy test because her and Vincent got into some things. But if y'all wanted to see more of that, y'all definitely got to head over to my Patreon because I do post the deleted scenes from Team Mom and stuff like that. So, yeah, we definitely got to make that happen, period. I think, well, maybe we'll wait until like this weekend to invite the family over and actually have like a sit down dinner. Oh, what's this? PA announcements. The PA loudly chirps on for some announcements. Liana doesn't really care to hear about the weather forecast or update to the school's social calendar. With no lessons going on, now seems like a good time to listen to tunes. We're gonna listen to the announcements. So it says, surprisingly everyone, the announcements have some interesting updates for once and Liana learned more about her fellow classmates. Yes, girl. We trying to stay in line and stay on the right track to graduate early. We don't got time for you to be um, listening to your music when we should be listening to the announcements. But yeah, I think we're going to invite everybody over this weekend to do the, uh, to just have like an actual dinner to sit everybody down and just talk about, you know, their plans and just the excitement for the engagement. We might do that, like. I'm not going to dedicate a whole episode to it, but just be something cute for her to do and while she's out of school and stuff. Or, I mean, since her mom is the only one that doesn't know, we can just invite her over 
and just cook a nice dinner. We really need to go grocery shopping, so I might have her do that beforehand. Like, basically, as soon as we get home, order, or actually, she has cheer practice, so we might order some groceries to the house right before she goes to cheer practice, and then we'll cook something new for dinner, invite her mom over, and, you know, tell the news to her mom about the engagement. The sister's looking so good. You sitting by yourself today, Liana. Where's Yasmin? I saw her walk in here. Yasmin's sitting over there. Do you want to come sit over here beside your bestie? Your bestie for the restie. I know you're not about to take our seat. Oh, that sucks. Oh, wait. Yeah, don't take our seat. Come sit over here, Liana. And then eat your food. Okay, well, sitting across from her ain't bad. Okay, I guess. You just couldn't listen to me all the way, could you? Let's just talk to our best friend. Let's ask her how she's doing today. Um, let's see. Let's express admiration to our bestie. That's working on her notes. Okay, Yasmin. And let's just really check in on her. Let's compliment her outfit. Yes, bestie for the restie. We love her. That's never going to change. I'm so glad that they really click. And I think Liana had a sentiment with somebody. It's probably gone, but okay. Ooh. Vincent want to have a quick woohoo session. It's every day. Like, so Yasmin is like, Bestie, I'm actually glad that you came over here and sat down because I have something to tell you. And then Liana's like, what's going on? Like, I thought I was the one that had the big news. And she's like, girl, let me tell you, I heard that there was a college party this weekend. And I know somebody that can get us in. And Liana's like, a college party? Yasmin, you already know I'm down, girl. You already know I'm down. Y'all know Liana was sneaking out to the club when she was, she was barely 16, y'all. Barely. Was she even 16? No, she was 16. So she's definitely like, yes, yeah, it's like, we can definitely go. Let me know, like, I can get us some outfits on Shein, on Shein, whatever y'all want to call it. I call it Shein. But she's like, I can get us some outfits on Shein. And she's like, yeah, so y'all, we just got invited to a freaking college party this weekend. Liana's not even in college yet, so to be invited to a college party while you're still in high school, like, she like, okay, we pretty lit, we pretty lit, so... I'm excited for that. So, y'all, the college party is actually on Monday. And the reason why that is is because y'all know when y'all in college, like, the Christmas break or the holiday break is so long. So, the college kids are out of school way before the high school kids are. So, Liana is going to have to skip school on Tuesday. So, yeah, so... Her and Yasmin gonna be skipping school on Tuesday, so what we'll probably do is just have Yasmin stay the night over Liana's house. They'll act like they're going to school, and then they'll just go out to the college party. Liana doesn't have to ask anybody because, I mean, she in her own spot, and she 18 now. At least that's how she feels. Yasmin, y'all know she still lives at home, but her mom and dad aren't gonna care that she's over Liana's house, and they don't know that they're planning to go to a college party, so they're thinking that they're gonna go to school. So we shouldn't have any issues there. So I think that's going to be pretty fun, pretty lit. And, you know, Liana wants to go to college so she can play it off as that as well. She can just be like, you know, I want to go check out the schools and, you know, get a little taste of the college life as they should. <laughs> so that's something exciting we got to look forward to. So this is big. An invite to a college party like that, that's pretty huge. We got the end of the day report. It says Liana impressed her teachers and learned a lot today. Period. She got cheer practice in 30 minutes, so we're going to get ready to head to that. All right, y'all. So Liana's about to head to cheer practice. So she's going to order the groceries on her way from cheer practice. So after that, she'll be heading home. So I will see y'all back at the house.
Alright y'all, so Liana came back from cheer practice. Oh no, wait, hold on. I'm hideous, my face is a mess. I can't go anywhere looking like this. What can I do? It's fine, don't overreact. Try some light makeup. Girl, you look fine. You don't need makeup. Even though you wear it, you don't need it. Liana came back from cheer practice. Everything went good. I'm pretty sure I put in a clip of the grocery shop and I probably sped it up because it was a lot. But yeah, we bought a lot of groceries. And Liana's going to make some lasagna al pesto. And we can actually go ahead and invite her mom over now. So I'm going to go ahead and have Vincent do that while Liana cooks. We're just going to invite her mother over. And I see Bryson coming up to the door. But Bryson, we'll have to hang out with him another day. He just loves to stop by, but we don't never let him in. <laughs> we'll never hang out with him. So maybe next time. Hopefully her mom comes by because she is putting in the work. Yes, she is putting in the work for her mom. Brianna done cooked so much the counter got dirty. Yeah, we love Brianna. That's great. Hopefully her mom should be here. I know y'all see that freaking money. Like her money went down so bad. Her mom is here. Yeah, Ooh, apologize to her. I don't know what he apologizing for, but apologize to her. Liana, not you got the same color hair as your mama. Okay, mama, the first thing you come in here doing is talking about it stinking here. Your daughter in here cooking for you. Y'all really haven't talked for real. Like, here, come talk to her. Like, you literally almost got the same color hair as your mama. Vince is apologizing. I don't know what he apologizing for, but whatever happened, just apologize. The girls are all in bed early, bright and early, because they need to get their sleep. They little growing babies. Um, but yeah, we're gonna hopefully dinner will be finished soon, so we can have this dinner. Cause I'm ready to go ahead and tell her. Oh, their relationship level is not the highest. Can we see their sentiments? Can we see it? No. Okay. Now she come in here cleaning. Okay, mama. She like, where are my grandbabies at? Mama, they sleep, okay? Hopefully it's excellent quality. Yes! It's excellent quality. I'm grab a servant because y'all know it's bomb. And then we also gonna go ahead and tell our mom. I guess she's gonna tell her mom. And then, y'all, look. They're gonna also view this picture together. So I did, I told y'all in the last part that we wanted to put at least one picture up of Liana and Vincent in the apartment and then when they moved to their house, y'all know it's gonna be photos everywhere of them and the girls. But yeah, we decided on this photo with a red frame, why not? Liana's gonna go look at that. Are you not hungry, babes? Your mom grabbed some food. And Vincent didn't grab a servant either because they're all dancing and talking, okay. And I think this is, is this her mom's first time? Coming over to her apartment, it might be, y'all. It really might be. Hmm. Not asked to be sim of honor at a wedding. I'm sorry. Either bestie Yasmin or cousin Jasmine gonna be the sim of honor. Let's just be real. But they're not worried about their wedding for a few years, y'all. Like, they're not just gonna run off and get married. They gonna take their time because they want something really nice. Oh, wait. I didn't know I was controlling. I didn't know. Okay. So let me see, we're going to, not the picky eater phase, Liana, please, why? <laughs> um, come hug your mom lovingly, thank her for coming over, and let's also compliment her outfit. Mama, you could have cleaned that plate up though, I'm just saying. I'm gonna definitely have them take some pictures together, but not Liana into the picky eater phase. Oh, you got to pump, babe. 
Nailani is woke. Okay. So maybe mama can come take care of Nailani. Hold on. Let's see. She like, is that my grandbaby in there crying? And she like, oh Lord, mama, what? I'ma go in here and uh come take care of my grandbaby. Okay. Mama, she's all right. I, I want to talk to my grandbaby. Okay. So let me come get her. I should have known. We should have invited you over another day when the girls didn't have to be in bed. And she's like, I'm going to go get my grandbaby. Hey, I know what I'm doing. I raised you and your brother just fine. I'm coming to get my grandbaby. What's wrong with her? Craving new flavors? She is tired of milk and she wants to try exploring baby food. Y'all, that's perfect because what did I say earlier in the episode? We are definitely, <laughs> we're definitely weaning her off. Like, listen, what are you doing? Okay. We're going to have her mom come explore some baby foods with her. So, yeah, grandma, y'all. Liana and Vincent be snapping. This is not me. This is them. Like, this is them. This is the same thing that happened in the last part. I'm going to go ahead and let them do what they do. But, like, we're not going to focus on that. We're going to focus on this baby trying some different foods. So, let's help her explore some foods. So, let's try the apple, strawberry, banana, baby meal. That's what Nailani wants to do. So, she's craving new flavors. She wants to try new things. Liana and Vincent going in that room to do God knows what. <laughs> But let's see if she likes it. Yeah, they, yeah. Does she like it? She was unsure. Okay, she's unsure about it. That's okay. The good thing is that we tried it because we never know what she's going to like until we try it. We can do super efficient infant care. Oh, she doesn't want to be around her grandbabies. Okay. I mean, she never really cut them off. I mean, yeah, she kicked Liana out. But she did tell Liana that the girls could stay. So, you know, I guess there's the pros and cons to this. But we're going to help her explore some more food since Nailani really wants to try other foods. She wants to explore some new flavors. So let's try the banana cinnamon and granola baby food. Okay. Okay. We're going to try that and see if she likes that. She's going to put that food away. And, you know, I'm happy that her mom and dad are happy for her engagement, Liana's engagement. And, like I said, Vincent had already talked to her parents before he proposed, but they just didn't know when he was planning to do it. But they're both still, oops, they're both still happy about it. She loved it! Yay! And then we're going to also view this photo. Well, first, let me let this baby out. We're going to pick her up. And then we're going to view this photo. My little baby. She is having a blast. I can't. I'm glad she found something that she loved. Other than that turkey meal stuff. Yeah. Go ahead and pick her up. Grandma Farah. Here, go ahead and pick this baby up and then we're gonna view the photo. Was well, she crawling trying to get away? So cute. And then Farah, you know, she is just so proud of her daughter. Like, they've come a long way. Y'all already know their relationship was a little, it was a little rocky when her parents, when Liana's parents first split. Because Liana just always wanted her family together. And I understand and everybody understand that things don't work out. So their relationship was a little rocky from there. They went to family therapy and a lot of things were uncovered. Where the relationship got even rockier between Liana and her parents. And of course after they found out she was pregnant at 16 with the twins. And then found out that she was pregnant again at 17 with Nailani. Everything just blew up, and it, it got real nasty real fast, and y'all know her mom kicked her out. Her dad stopped talking to her, and she had to go stay with her cousin Jasmine for a couple days. She lucked up on this apartment, thankfully she did. And, you know, things are slowly trying to get back to what they were. I don't think it'll ever get back 100% to how it was before, 
everything happened like i don't i don't ever think they're gonna get back 100 percent to how it was before but they can work on having a better relationship for the sake of the girls at least but Farah is really proud of her daughter like she has come a long way she's doing great in school she's gonna graduate early despite the odds against her like having three kids by the time she was 17 like you know everybody doubted her being able to do this but leona got her own place she's doing great she has a wonderful man by her side he's an amazing father to all three girls and they're just doing really good like you know money could be a little bit better but they're managing with what they got they're not you know being crazy or frivolous with their money so fair knows that her daughter is doing a great job and it just makes her so proud it makes her so proud and of course She'll love her daughter unconditionally as well as her granddaughters and any more kids Liana may have or may not have, whatever. Like, she's going to love them no matter what. And she's going to step up to the plate just like her dad. And they're going to try to be better parents to Liana and be the best parents to these babies that they can be. But yeah, y'all, I think I'm going to go ahead and leave this part right here. I hope y'all enjoyed. I know I did. Remember to like, comment, subscribe, and share my videos. Also, don't forget to turn on your post notifications. So you never miss out when I post. Alright, Simmies. I'll see y'all in the next video.